Well, good evening. We have issued a weather alert day for Saturday. Currently, we're just seeing cold rain across the viewing area. This is right around 530 uh, and we've been tracking showers through much of the evening hours. A cold rain out there. We're starting to see somewhat of a change over to snow off towards the north and the east. Uh, but as we get closer, that will fall that will fall further and further towards the south. We just saw 37 degrees on the board for make. And of course, this is right around 530, but it's a cold rain out there. Eventually, we will see a change over to snow as we get closer to nine o'clock. And as we head towards the early morning hours tomorrow, Tomorrow, that's where we're starting to see it spread further towards the south, closer to that I-70 corridor. And then south of I-70 looks like mostly a early morning tomorrow issue, at least the onset of snow. We'll likely see snow through the midday hours and maybe even the afternoon hours to the south. So track this out here hour by hour. Temperatures will fall closer to freezing and as such, We'll likely see that switch over to blue that switch over to snow follow suit pretty carefully or pretty quickly. And then this is that line of heavy snow kind of marching on in. Once we see that changeover should be pretty good snow rates, at least initially, and that will continue to fall further and further towards the south and west. And that's where we'll start to see more and more accumulations as we head throughout the morning hours. But our best accumulation still expected to the northwest where that initial band sets up early on in the overnight hours, 46 inches likely for folks to the north of this blue line. Moberly may very well be in there as well, and including parts of the Brunswick uh, area over towards Sheraton County. Uh, but as you head further towards the south, we'll start to see those totals start to drop off, in particular the south and west. If you head east, um, if you pick a point and just head east, generally your totals should increase. Overall, we're looking at most of us falling somewhere in between this two to four inch mark. This is a uh, point forecast for Columbia. Generally, anything more than two inches looking less and less likely. Uh, our best chance coming uh, really two inches and less. But area wide, I think most of us fall anywhere between that two to four inch range. Our most concerning threat is going to be roads as we're heading out tomorrow. It'll be a, a thick, heavy, wet snow, so it'll likely um, be kind of hard to clear for folks, especially with shovels. Uh, but as you head towards uh, the midday hours, things should start to slow down, should start to get that out of here. We're also concerned with some visibility, especially as that snow falls during the overnight hours through some of those heavier snow periods. Sunday, we're dry, temperatures close to freezing still, uh, so we really don't see much improvement in how much snow is on the ground. We'll likely see some snow compacting, but other than that, we really don't see a good chance for snow melting until we get to Monday.